What's up crew? We got an exciting new install, another Dobinson's install that we are doing today. So we're running the Dobinson's lift. Many of you have seen that video. Extended travel in the front, long travel rear with the, their UCAs. But today what we're doing is we're putting in a snorkel. And the reason we're doing a snorkel is I've chopped up my wheel well pretty good putting this bumper on there. And with that, I have to clean out my air filter all the time. So I figured a better way to combat that instead of just doing filter after filter, cleaning after cleaning would be get that intake out above the wheel well where it's not getting a tire constantly throwing dirt in its face. I did a photo contest when some muddy with Aiden James Customs and was able to put that towards the snorkel. And so I got a snorkel for a really great deal. And I'm thankful for Scott over there, Aiden James. But today we are going to be installing this. Now I've seen lots of videos, some not very detailed, some over the top detailed and a lot of information. Here's what I wanna do. I wanna make this as simple as possible, all right? I know you guys are trying to get through an install and make this thing happen. So I'm gonna take this thing apart. We're gonna jump into the install. We're gonna make this thing happen pretty quick, hopefully. As you can see, we got lots of really great stuff here. We got the snorkel itself, the connection for the air box, the head for the snorkel, instructions, template, bracket for the pillar, a ton of hardware to mount this thing. I got a Dremel, got a drill, got some sealant, got some cotton pads to touch up paint so we don't have any rust, and of course some paint. So all these things are gonna be necessary for us to make this install happen. <laughs> 